Welcome friends, old and new. My name is Olivia and my partner Chico and I are from Chicago. In 2021, we packed up our things after three years of living in New York City to fulfill our lifelong dream of seeing the world. Since then, we have lived and slow traveled throughout Guatemala, Mexico, Costa Rica, the Philippines, and in this vlog, Japan, where we spent three months in 2023. We spent three months in Japan living and working remotely and wanted to spend our last weekend in Japan in one of our favorite places, Kyoto. We stayed in Kyoto over the summer for almost three weeks and we couldn't wait to return. We were lucky enough to witness Kyoto in the autumn, eat incredible food, of course visit many cafes, watch a cultural performance, and take an unexpected hike where we got to catch these unreal views of Kyoto. While this is see you later Japan for now, it means so much to me that you are enjoying these videos and I hope you continue to follow along on our next journey. I will be putting together a guide to Japan with tips and answering all your questions, so leave any questions in the comments below. Also, I'd like to invite you to subscribe to my Substack newsletter where I'll be sharing more in-depth guides and tips from Japan and beyond. Thank you again for watching and as always we hope this little glimpse on our journey makes your day and may inspire you to grind some coffee, take a walk, or book that ticket you've been considering. Please remember to like and subscribe and if you're interested check out my other Japan vlogs from our first days or even the Mexico series. I hope to see you again soon. We are heading to Kyoto. It's about a 30 minute, one hour ride. I think I got my feet to be comfortable.
So we've been here in summer now and in fall, and both are amazing, but these leaves here are gorgeous. I friggin' love it. grab another coffee get some food walk around the sun is going to be going down soon um but yeah our neighborhood is so beautiful here ah, it feels so good to be back in kyoto we're staying at this hotel and that's the street
Good morning everyone, it's Sunday. I uh, woke up early and kind of early, not as early as we'd like, but now we are gonna head to breakfast.
Those persimmons are crazy. Hmm? So I'm not even ready. Dressed. Obviously I'm wearing lipstick to go on a hike. And now we're doing this beautiful hike. And it's been like two hours to get up. I'm wearing a skirt my new shoes it is beautiful look at that we're leaving kyoto today unfortunately we've been here for two days and we're heading back to osaka tonight and we still have to get some souvenirs because i want to get my mom and my sister and her family some teas from kyoto and my mom wants something like with the geisha Geiko and I want some teas to take back. Nope, we make it. It's pretty much all that we have out to do, but I'm sad to leave. Kyoto has my heart. Holy smokes, we finally made it. We made it! I think from a lot of our vlogs, you can learn from us to be prepared for hikes, bring water, bring snacks. It's just we didn't know we were doing this. But look how beautiful that is. Kyoto in the fall is.
you guys serious? Can I see my camera? I gotta get a... Look, there's people down there. We did it. <whistles> Treated with some tea. Now we need to find some food. Look at the street. So this is where we ended. I don't remember doing that. We'll be back. We're leaving. Uh -huh. We're staying. One more night. <laughs> <laughs> he always does this. A view of Kyoto Tower. Just walking to the hotel. Three. We only booked this one hour ago. <laughs> nice. And they gave us laundry to search Nice. For $77 a night, this is what you get. Nice. <gasps> Look at that little teapot. What? Oh, cool. It's always in the bathroom, but that's okay. Tub. Yeah.